guys, welcome to today. Yeah, this is morning Laura. This is no coffee Laura. This is the Laura who has to get up at the crack of dawn to do stuff. So, uh, Gabby slept at Kayla's last night. Okay, let me explain. Let's let's back up and tell you what's happened in here. So basically, uh, uh, we Sam and I took Sophie. Whoa, I'm dropping my keys. Sam and I took Sophie into riding lessons last night to see Storm. And Gabby, yes, I know you got your supper, your breath coming. She's been laying down. Um, Sophie and I, Sophie and Sam and I went to riding lessons. Gabby went with Fiona. Gabby went with Fiona. And um, and Kaylee, and they were riding ponies last night. Ugh. Oh man! Ugh. Hold on. So, how do spider webs appear overnight? Like that's crazy to me. But anyways, uh, Fiona's having camp today for a bunch of little kids, and she's doing it at our barn, which is super exciting. And. Okay, so Fiona's having camp, and she has like different ponies that she's using, and Gabby and Kaylee went to ride the camp ponies to make sure that they were ready for the little kids. So then Gabby stayed at Kaylee's house. We're gonna catch up with them just a few more minutes. And then, yeah, man, my brain is not thinking. Uh oh, other than Daisy just went outside. Come on, Daisy. And, oh, you're gonna pee? All right. All right. So let's start this day. I'm waiting for Sophie. I need to get up. I had to just throw my hair together. We are headed out super super early at the crack of dawn. Sophie's coming down to help me put the ponies out. And then I'll catch you guys up when we get there. Okay, so we're just getting ready to go out. I don't have minutes to show you Penny. Oh, you drink lots of water. Don't have minutes to show you how calm and relaxed Penny is in the morning. I have no minutes to show you that. How she lets me put her mask on brush her, make sure there's no knots or any bad stuff on her. No time to show you how calm she is in the morning. No time. She lets me do whatever I need to do to her in the morning. Like, the horse is so calm. Like that, she's she's patient. That's what she is. She's such a yeah, patient. I didn't yeah. It didn't pop. Good girl. Oh, my cat's here. So yeah, my cat's here. Molly won't do anything to you. Molly! Molly keeps coming in through the fence. But I'm gonna give him some treats and pet him. Okay, all right, let's go. We're in a hurry. It's funny how even when you're in a hurry, whoa, even when you're in a hurry, horses always slow you down. I think, stop eating the grass. Hold on there, I've got her from the wrong side. So yeah, like, it's funny, no matter how much of a hurry you're in, you always stop to be kind and gentle and soft and pet them and, all right, hold on. Hold on, sister. Hold on, I gotta put the gate up. Took her mask off and she's like, wait, do you have treats for me? Because if you have treats, I'll take them. Nice out today, it's supposed to rain, so it's kind of like windy and weird. She's getting faster. That's how a girl knows her horse is getting better and better and better. She's just like, see? My horse walks with purpose. <laughs> I love that about her. And that's how I knew there was something wrong with her, is that she goes slow. That's the only thing that really like made me know that she was not, that something was bothering her, was that she got slow, because my girl's not slow. I forgot I had to go back in for another horse. Am I taking Gracie? I don't like walking any other horse because they don't have um, manners. Oh, I Sophie, yes. Yeah, Sophie pointed out Gracie's already, or Penny's already way down at her favorite spot. Like, the girl has a good memory and she has a good understanding. She figures things out. Wait a minute, you're getting too fast. Well, and I actually made him. You know what somebody said? Can you move forward, please? Yeah. I don't want them fighting. They don't fight. Oh yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. Um, so do you know what somebody said? How to get the correct lead? Oh, I already learned. What um, What do you have to do? Um, I have to not let them think about trotting before they can turn. So what they said was put your outside leg and open your inside rein, and you know how to do that. Gracie's trotting. Gracie's going, and then Willow's probably gonna go. Oh, now she's cantering. Wee! I'm what coming, do Betty. You know about Willow, is she doesn't run. She does. Uh oh. Told ya. No, she does. Molly! 
She needs a little run. Look at her go. She looks like a camel or a alpaca. Oh my gosh, I can't even see my hurt horse. It's because there's a little hill there, not just because the grass is tall. Oh. <laughs> you can't even see Willow. Can't, oh, I see Gracie. Whoops. I see Gracie. Doo -doo -doo. And Penny. And no Willow. All right, let's go. All right, this is the, the camp, pony camp. They're doing camp today, did you know? Yes, I knew. That's why I thought I'll try to uh, get in here a little earlier. Oh, that's nice. Wave, so. Yeah, I'm not staying. <laughs> I don't, I'm not a camp girl. Oh, yeah, well. Oh, it's so cute. Or yeah. She is really loud for a mini. She's a mini. Or is she a pony? She's a big mini. She's really cute, though. I, I love her. I love her. So she's a mini? She's an actual mini? Or she's a pony? We have no idea what she is. Oh. Well, are you buying her? No. I want to buy her. <laughs> I want to buy all the horses. My friends are. You would have to fight with Mike over this one. Oh, I love Mike her. Mike is in love with Tank. Oh, I love her. Oh yeah, she was for sale. You told me. They run, they run, they swim. Isn't there archery? Yeah. No, I think it's fencing. Oh my God, we can do that. <laughs> you guys are gonna go in the Olympics. So, anyways, uh, Gabby and Kaylee are counselors. Sophie is a counselor. Gabby is a counselor. She's gonna take care of little kids. There's six kids today. Um, and uh, the vet's coming today, which is awful because it's camp day and the vet is coming. I don't know, he only calls me like when he's on his way. So, so you're staying? So I'm not staying. I'm gonna try and go home because it could be afternoon. So yeah, there's all, all right. that. So I'm gonna grab my clothes. Come here. I got everybody drinks and cookies and tea for Fiona. It was a little bit chaotic. I'm just gonna explain two things. One, um, uh, I don't think I t updated you guys that the vet is coming today. Today's the day and it's camp at our barn. So we're going to be doing like a bunch of tests in Chino. He's doing much better. He it got freed. Like he doesn't have to stay in a stall, but I, there's still, I don't know. We're anyways, the vet is coming today. So we're going to, I've been in contact with the vet the whole time because I can email him and that, and text him and that is so good. Um, so he's been helping me so he knows like everything that's going on. So, but he's going to be here today and Gabby and Sylvia are both being counselors in Fiona's camp. So that's exciting. First camp I've ever taken the kids to and not had to pay. <laughs> so, um, they're doing camp. The vet is coming. And also, Fiona brought me this. So this is something I'm going to try on Storm. You guys, um, I don't know if you saw in today's video, there's lots of flies. Because they have smaller pens, not as much room for the horses to run and move around. So I find that the flies really congregate more in areas like that. Like here, they can just, the horses can be so spread out that the flies don't all congregate together. So um, I can't put a fly mask on him because... He stays out and it would not be good at, at night. So if you want to give me this, I'm going to put a breakaway halter on him and then I'm going to put this so that it can keep the flies out of his eyes. So I think that's going to work. But anyway, let's go home. The vet, how the vet works is that they just phone you uh, like 20 minutes before they come and then I'm going to try and race back. But if I am not back, I'll just text them, Fiona and Gabby, and then they know, like he already knows what's going on. So. Yeah, that's it. It's gonna be a busy, big day. So let's go. So I'm in the barn and I'm doing chores. I got the puppies. Got one puppy, two puppy, three puppy. They're confused. They're like, where is everybody? Hey, that's not cool. And Gabby just messaged me and said, can you bring the drinks? So I guess I'm going back to the barn. I'm going back. I understand, it's hot. They need me. Mom to the rescue, mom to, oh, I just stepped in something. Mom to save the day. I'll be back, puppies. I'll be back, horses. All right, so I'm at camp. Whoopsie. And they made me go get the McDonald's. Made me get the McDonald's. McDonald's run. Yeah. What happens when you have kids? Yeah. Can you go get the drinks? I don't know how I forgot the drinks. I know how. I don't think it was all my fault. Can you get the drinks and close the car door for me? Please, sure. please and thank Your you. Okay. I was about to say please and thank yeah. you. I sometimes take a breath and then you I said it you before were. me. Yeah. <laughs> I sometimes do that too when I cut people off and I'm like, I'm just <laughs> I was about to say it, I swear. I asked how Gabby's been as a counselor and she said good, I knew she would be. She, she says she doesn't like kids, but she actually is really good with them, especially little boys, because she's kind of like a little boy. 
so, so good. yeah, so bad. No drinks. I'm sorry. From now on, you're in charge of making sure your lunch is out of the car. Okay. Okay. So this is the morning run and this is the lunchtime run. Tomorrow it's real food, sister. Oh, Sophie, are you in charge of crafts? Yes. yes. Paige was with me, but then Fiona did. Yeah, so all the other kids are have riding the ponies. The ponies are adorable. This is the craft room. What are you making? A boat? A stable. A stable? Well, a, stall. a stall? Can I show yours? Yeah. This is one of the other girls' stall. stalls. That's super cool. I love it. Look at that's where they had to plug in the glue guns. Mike, don't judge it. I'm not judging. I'm not judging. The vet is here and we're just gonna tell him, let him examine Chino. We think we know what the problem is. Alright, vet is coming in. We are waiting. We are just finishing camp. It is crazy here. Lots of people. Into your driveway, it's a Saturday night. You look like a million bucks wearing that dress I like. You're smiling, but there's something missing in your eyes. Girl, I can tell that you have something on your mind. But I will make you forget all your sorrows. Let go like there's no tomorrow. Let's have a drink, just relax, all your problems will fade If you're ready for a good time, count on me There's a party in the backyard, dance your problems away I'm all about the good vibes, I know you're all about the good vibes Do you know how much I love you, wanna see you smile Where's the happy girl that I know with a heart on fire? going to do x-rays just to make sure that everything's okay but he just thinks he needs like some kind of different thing in his shoes so that it offloads his feet a little bit because he's still a little bit foot sore and he's only a little bit foot sore in the heels and he's mildly lame and doesn't see any other problem so we're gonna do x-rays so that I can give them to the the, the farrier and then the farrier is gonna take care of figuring out what he needs for his feet Literally, like, he said nothing. He's a little bit foot sore in the heel, and that's it. But I asked him if he would do x rays so that we can just have it for the farrier, and that's what we're doing. All right, so Chino just pooped. Gabby has to clean it up. Are they both off? Are they both off work? Kaylee had to work. Are you sure? He got a light sedation. We didn't see him do it, but we're looking and we're thinking that, yeah, he may be sedated now. He might have to step back home. All right. Gabby's wearing her first dress. How much does your dress weigh, Gabby? I know. I love it, too. It's so super cool. He's <laughs> just relaxed. can balance what kind of sport can you do for balancing Gabby's out there with a little girl on her and she is playing she got kicked yeah Gabby got kicked Gabby's being a horse with a little girl on her back yeah because Kaylee took a break Kaylee's babysitting the other baby now he's almost done he's almost ready he has sedation he has to wait an hour but you can already see his head's coming up he's doing better and he gets to go out really soon so i'm gonna tell you guys what's wrong so many people have been really good about giving us suggestions saying like you know when my horse is lame with this and chino looks just like him and so i was telling him like all the things that people were thinking like it could be and he said you know let's just just x-ray the heck out of him and let's like check everything and and he did like a whole lameness evaluation he did like checked his neck he checked like he checked everything and what happened what Chino has is 
Are you guys ready? Because it's shocking. Like, it's so shocking. I'm going to tell you guys, and you're going to have to comment below if you were right. I was wrong. He you know, has nothing wrong with him. Nothing. He's, his feet look gorgeous. There's no sign of laminitis. There's no sign of navicular. There's no sign of like, he looked at, I have like, he's sending me the x-rays. They were so many x-rays. Um, uh, what happened is that Chino you know, steps wrong. He's really thin soled, more thin on the right than on the left. And sometimes he steps on something and it bruises his foot, just like last year. Um, so yeah, he has thin, thoroughbred feet. The right side is thinner than the left side. And every once in a while, he's stepping on something. It's making him like have a little bruise. And two days later, it's good again. And that's what's wrong with Chino. That's the, all of it. I. That's all of it. So it's just so crazy that all just such a little thing could cause like so much issues. But so his recommendation is to put like a leather pad or a rubber pad. I forget. Anyway, he's sending the the, the um, X-rays to the farrier so that the farrier can deal with. It. All right, so we are home already. We haven't cleaned yet. Dogs have to go out, and Gabby got a package. So Gabby. Or, One of my two packages, I believe. Yeah, Gabby ordered stuff. It's supposed to be here in seven more days. It came seven days. Gabby ordered stuff. Ordered stuff from Sheen two weeks. No, a week ago, and already it's here. My name on it. You know you're growing up when mail has your name on it. She said. That's nice and sharp. Yeah, that's it's why. It's not useful to stab anybody with it because it's too flimsy. It's yeah, it's interesting that you know that, Gabby. Wow. So she bought bathing suits. Yeah. Three bathing suits? And a sweater. And a sweater. I got four. Whoa, four and bathing sweater. suits. And a sweater. Yeah. We realized- a sweater a size bigger, a size medium. She wasn't sure, I'm but look at how nice small. the packaging is. I wanted it oversized. So, you know. Oh hey, yeah, it looks like it's my yeah. size. Yeah, it's cute. Oh, it's from China, so everything's smaller. Okay, we're good. Bathing suits will fit. Yeah, I think that it's actually bigger than you're probably thinking. Hmm. Yeah, it's oversized. It's good. No, it's it's the same as my other size smalls. Oh, all right. That well, is my bathing suit. It says Los it. Angeles, California. Super cute. It's a little big. She said she only has three sweaters that I'm she wears. Too. So, yeah, so she needed new sweaters. But I like them ordering clothes. Anyway, we've been at the barn practically all day. The girls did camp. Gabby was amazing. Sophie loves kids and always does amazing. Gabby was like rocking the baby. Gabby was um, carrying little girls around on her back, giving them horsey rides, and she was awesome at camp. So. Hi. So I was telling my, I was telling the vet about Penny about how like. She's getting faster. She's moving better. She's like, she runs sometimes to, to me in the field instead of like going slow because she started going slow, which is like I said, how I knew there was a problem. And he said that that's really amazing and that that's hopeful, helpful, yeah. hopeful. Um, anyways, he's saying like that's really, really, I forgot the word that he used. He uses uh, encouraging, but that's not the word he used. But anyway, it's encouraging basically that She's moving faster, she's wanting to do more, and he's coming soon to reevaluate her and tell us the next step. A hoodie without sweating. <laughs> it's a black hoodie. Gabby said it's really hot. Normally I can wear a hoodie without sweating. Yeah, yeah. this is all I wear in the summer. I know, but it's black, Gabby. It's black. black. Well, this is new. Please go. <laughs> Gabby, Gabby be bragging. All right, listen, Penny Pickle. Don't You're be a pickle. Penny, yeah, see, that's how you can tell she's getting better. She just runs for me. <laughs> all right, she's going with Gabby. Gabby, they're all coming with you. What she does is she like, lead me on, lead me on, and then all of a sudden she'll be like, fine, catch me. Literally, I can tell when Penny's going into heat. I know I said it yesterday, she's not in heat. I think Willow is in heat though, but I could tell she's going into heat because she has the same pattern every time. She runs for me in the field, and then she well, she just gets sassier, but not bad. And then she gets spooky. Isn't that weird? Like, that's one of her signs, is that she gets spooky. All right, so we still have to do chores. We still have to do chores and cool down, and we're going to the beach? Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to the beach. Mm -hmm. 
Don't you know that you're beautiful?